Paxton is a diesel shunter who works at the Knapford Shunting Yards. He keeps busy pushing and pulling trains into place. Paxton is cheerful and friendly to everyone he meets. He's even friends with Diesel, and that says it all, doesn't it? One day, Percy came to the yards feeling very grumpy. Cheer up, Percy, said Paxton. It's a lovely day. It's been a very boring day for me, Percy groaned. I've been helping Mavis at the quarry a lot lately. It's just been stone, 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 and trucks, 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 and I'm bored, bored, bored. I suppose you have more trucks for me? I'm sorry, Percy, said Paxton, and he showed Percy a long line of trucks. Oh, bother. Uh, I just wish I could do something else. What about you? What about me? Do you wish you could do a different job for a change? Um, not really, said Paxton earnestly. I like shunting. I'm not really interested in doing anything else. Suit yourself. And with that, Percy set off with his train. A few days later, Emily was getting ready to take the Vid Express, and Patton was collecting the coaches. Emily must be happy to be taking the Express, he thought. She must like the change. Patton shunted the Express coaches into place, and in a few short minutes, Emily set off. An hour or so later, Percy came into the shunting yards looking grumpier than ever. Patson was just about to talk to him when the station master came up. Emily's piston rods have snapped, he said. You two are the only engines available. Please, go help her. Percy's frown turned into a smile. Hooray, he cried. Finally, something new to do. Come on, Patson, let's show those passengers what we're made of. And Percy raced off with Patson following behind. Emily was looking defeated as Percy and Paxton arrived. Pulling the express is no joke, she said. I hope you two can manage. Don't worry, Emily, said Paxton cheerfully. We'll do wonders. Soon, Paxton and Percy were coupled up and then were set off down the line. The journey was difficult, but Paxton and Percy did everything they could to try to stay on time. Gordon's Hill was soon in view. Paxton and Percy charged the hill, but the coaches felt very heavy here. It took a long time before the two finally reached the top. Percy was exhausted, but Paxton was excited for the sprint down the hill. At last, Paxton and Percy reached the final station. As the two engines caught their breath, Rosie cheered for Percy, Diesel cheered for Paxton, and Sir Topham Hat, as well as all the passengers, cheered for both. So what did you think of pulling the express, Paxton? asked Percy. It was fun, replied Paxton, but I don't think I want to do it again. I like being a shunter, although I wouldn't mind doing another job every once in a while. Well, said Percy, I don't want to pull the express again either. It was tiring. I won't complain about pulling trucks ever again. Paxton hoped that Percy was being serious, but knowing Percy, he'll probably start complaining again sometime soon.